How you guys doing? This is Hybrid Steel. Welcome back to Lawnmower Simulator 2, the excruciatingly fun game where you control a lawnmower and a strimmer and cut grass. And that's pretty much it. Right. So, I did do a really big mission. I had to go and cut down like all this grass off of like a Stonehenge looking place. Turns out my microphone wasn't connected and it was replaying through my camera. The sound was awful. The video was crap. So I decided, hey, screw it, we've got to go and do something else. So thankfully, I finished that mission. Now I'm going to go and do 58 Coryville Street. Is it Coeville? Coville? Yeah, 58 Coville Street. Its complexity is one, which means I'm just cutting grass. And it looks like there's a swim pool there as well. Fantastic. We're going to give you 325 skidoodles for this one. And also... I did upgrade my place, which means my building gets upgraded. I don't know what that means. I think maybe I'll be able to get like somebody working for me, like you know, a minion, and we'll try and get someone in. But at the end of the day, I just need help, and the reason why is because I need to earn more money. And if I can earn more money, then I can get more people, and then I can just sit on my ass all day and not do nothing, and just hire people to work for me. Moo ha ha ha! It's alright, cause I'm safe by the mower. Ah oh, yes, this is the. Uh, this is the garden. Wow, actually, see, this is quite a nice garden. I mean, I wouldn't do it myself because I don't like cutting grass in real life. Uh, it, actually, no, state that. I hate cutting grass in real life. Right, let's go. Let's go and have a look around because we've got to go and find three objects that could be in the grass. Somewhere. Ah, there's one. A frisbee of sorts. Ah, another one. A frisbee of sorts. And whatever that is, a ball. Fantastic. And going by this, I'm going to have to scoot over this with a strimmer because I can't get my mower down there. Might be able to get it in there as well. You we have to strim up the back of here because we can't get that in there. All right, not too shabby. Right, let's get the mower out first and do what we can. And then let's get all baroovy groovy. All right, so changing the camera. Holding down Z. Start your engines. Oh yes. Oh, hold on. Six to seven centimeters. Fantastic. So if I bring this down to six, we can do six centimeters. We'll be fine. Oh no. And here we go. Right. Um. Pop that down. No, pop that up. And we are engaged. Oh yes, right. Now I, yeah, I was gonna say I don't think I'm gonna get down there, so I'll just destroy this woman's plants. We're all good, don't worry. Oh, okay, there's a big concrete wall there. Not bad. Within 30 seconds, I've been fined. It's not bad. Not bad at all. We will do a proper job. Don't worry. Right, let's go. Let's just take a bit more time over things, shall we? Yeah. Oh, there's another collision. Apparently, I can't quite get close enough to the bike. Oh, flipping egg. Here's me going, yeah, we need to take our time with this one. Yeah. How's that working out for me so far? This is how you keep remaining clients. Don't screw up. Right, I think I might just cut this corner. I'll do that with the strimmer. And there we go. Oh, yes. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Brilliant. Look at that. All right, much better now. There's going to be a, lot, a little bit of streaming going on after this, but we shouldn't be too bad. Oh, yes. Oh, look at that cut. It's like the graces of gods on my on the garden. Apart from where I've, like, mowed down their plants as well. It's all fun and games until plants get hurt. And then it's still fun and games. <laughs> plants come and go. And so do I. 
As long as I don't mark their flight garden with like wheel tracks, we'll be fine. Skibby dub 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 This is an easy garden. I like this one. Alright, and then we reverse again, go around the corner. So much easier than bloody Stonehenge. Stonehenge took me an hour, took me 112 minutes to do Stonehenge. Or what looks like Stonehenge, just like, you know, not quite Stonehenge. But, the reason why it kept taking me so long is because like, you got this limit that you can only rev up as much as, as, as a certain amount. And the problem with the limit is because the grass was so long, you had to cut at a certain rate. And it was like, if you cut too much, that's it. They would just stop working. I was like, oh man. It took me 112 minutes. And the record on that was like 40 something. So I'm going to assume it was for like a later on law, law, mower. Like this little thing can't cut that fast. It can only do like four and a half miles now. Too much. Too much. Too much. Well, that's nice cut, that is. We'll, we'll take that little lump. Alright, cool. Right, everything else I'm going to be doing with the strimmer. Because it's all quite small work. So, it's going to take me a little bit longer to do it. But, you know, that's not bad. 85% with the mower. We can't do much else because it's all a bit narrow. On the plus side, I could just get one of those smaller lawn mowers. Well, I could if I got some money. Right, we'll fill it up for 72p. Fantastic. Right, out for the strimmer. There we go. So we've got 85.4% done with the mower. That's not too shabby. Right. If it was actually easy to do this grass, like, if it was easy to do this in real life, like, I'd do it more, but it's not this easy. Like, in real life, it's back-breaking work. And I'm not getting any younger. That's why I don't mind doing it, like, sitting in a chair, playing it on a game, because this isn't hurting my back, and I'm fine. All I know is it's really hot. Now, in the UK, currently, we're having, like, a mini heat wave. And it's uncomfortable. And I'm recording this at half past ten at night and it's still 28 degrees. I don't have aircon and it sucks. Scooby dooby doo up. Oh, smeg, sorry. Broke one of their plants. Now, unfortunately, I think I'm done with most. I've got this feeling they've got like a small garden around the front. So let's go and check the front. Yeah, just as I thought. Right, 98%. What have I missed? Got to find this, like, last 1.6%. I think this might be it. Nope. 98.9%. Alright, 99%. There's 1% of grass left on this thing. 1%. Where are you, you 1%? I bet it's around this corner, isn't it? It's just going to be right in the middle. I 
I'm missing 0.7% of grass. The worst part is, is to me it all looks the same. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, freedom. What a lovely garden this is. Lovely garden. Just, I'm the one who cut it. Now it looks a bit horrible. Half an hour would be all good. Charged up and ready to go. Excellent. Right, well, what a nice little job that was. Let's go. I still think this would be pretty cool. Is if they were doing this like view, then you see like the before and the after then you actually get a gist of what I did or what you do if you play this game as well. All right, cool. And Woody's roundup today. Uh, ground check time, six, six pounds and 32 pence. That's good. Ground check earnings, 20 quid, all good. Penalties and fines, 17 pounds and 29p. So technically I made like five quid. That's not bad. Oh, flowers destroyed, nine pounds. Fantastic, there goes all my bonuses. Collisions, eight pounds and 29p. And vehicle maintenance, one pound and AP. I still earn three hundred and twelve pounds, so I'm all good with that. Money earned two thousand five hundred and thirty-one pounds. Vehicle maintenance included services. Right? Vehicle price uh, purchases, yeah, okay. And weekly loss, two thousand four hundred. Yay, man! We're doing good. And there we go. Apparently, my thing is still upgrading, so that's um, that's fun. So I've still got a few. I've, got, I've still got time to wait on that one, unfortunately. So the next one is a campsite, um, Foxton Holiday Park. Sounds amazing. Uh, the player must be assigned to the contract vehicle. What is it? Is it just a garbage thing or is it like, am I having to do a cut as well? It's only 25 quid. It's a litter pick. Oh, we'll just do that. We'll do a litter pick. It's fine. At the end of the day, it helps out. It helps out a community. Also, it, it might speed up the process of me doing my thing. And here we are. What a lovely little campsite this is. This is glamping. This isn't just camping. Lovely. Uh, cool. All right. One piece of litter. Excellent. Aha! Two pieces of litter. Ah, ah, ah. All right. Next. Three pieces of litter. Ah, ah. This is a really, really nice place. Like, this is, I mean, this isn't camping. Right. This is glamping. This is like, you know, if you come here, this means you're too posh for a tent. And this is too posh for me. Like, if I'm going to be completely honest, the only reason why I would come here is because my wife has trouble sitting in tents nowadays. But apart from that, these these are these are really nice, but this is too posh for me. I would feel really out of place being in a place like this. I'm salt of the earth. I'll sleep in a tent. I've got to be honest, I'd sleep in a flipping box if, if you had to. Reason for it is because I've already done that in my life. It doesn't bother me. Boxes, multi-story car parks, kids playgrounds, slept in them all. Kids playgrounds was a good one, right? We went out for a massive like overhaul. One of my like my friends turned 20 years ago. And uh, we got so drunk that we didn't know where we were. And we just ended up sleeping in a park. And then I woke up the next day and I was sitting underneath one of those little climbing frames. My friend was hanging upside down off of a zip line, which was brilliant. And then I had one friend who was like, he was, he fell asleep sitting at the top of a slide. All the joys of life, man. If you're not out experiencing it, well, what are you doing with your life? But I chose the safer option because I mean, if it had rained, I was under a climbing frame. I knew I was fine. Right, I need two more bits of like rubbish. Where are you, rubbish? It's gonna be. It's gonna be along here, isn't it? it? Has to be along here. Have I been up this bit yet? Ah, one. Where's the last piece? It's gonna be stuck in the, like an underwear drawer somewhere, isn't it? One more piece of rubbish left. Ah, there you are. Fantastic. You know what? This is a nice little place. I like this one. Brings back good memories of like things I've done in the past as well. It's brilliant. Hey, look at that. Valuables recovered, zero. Oh man, was there stuff left? Ah, oh, that's my fault. I, I wasn't paying attention. 
Damn it, we're gonna have to do that another time. All right, my upgrade is still in progress, so I don't know what's happening. Apparently, it's still got another three days. Oh, it's upgrading the bay. I might be able to hire somebody. That's gonna be awesome. So my next job is gonna be Miller Brook. It's a garden. Oh, I think I remember this from like the first time I ever played this. It's quite a big garden, so I'll leave that for another day. Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, hit that like, subscribe, and notification button below for all other updates. I will be back here with a brand new video, live stream, or whatever else I do on this channel. Until then, thank you very much for kicking by. I'll catch you later. Honestly, peace out, have fun, enjoy everything you guys do. Bye-bye for now.